probably noticed if you watch our news, car thefts are rising around the metro and around the country. A CBS News investigation uncovered police only clear or make an arrest in a fraction of those cases. That investigation found car thefts in Minneapolis doubled from 2019 to 2022. While the percentage of cars recovered increased, the number of arrests plummeted. Last year, only two out of every 100 reported thefts were solved. Tonight, a different Metro Police Department is sounding the alarm about a new way crooks may be trying to steal cars. A key piece of equipment was stolen during an armed robbery, and cops are concerned that specialized tool could lead to more car crimes. WCCO's Reg Chapman explains. A call for service near a Brooklyn Park apartment complex last week turned into a nightmare for a local locksmith. When he got there, he ended up getting uh, flagged down by the suspects who then uh, pointed guns at him and asked for the key programmers that they that locksmiths carry. Police are concerned that stolen key programmer could be used in future crimes. A lot of vehicles that have like my, some type of microchip or chipping within that key, that the, the vehicle actually reads that microchip or that chipping piece in the key to make that vehicle start. So it's a way for people to potentially go and steal vehicles in the future. Your security is our priority. Locksmith Tyler Martinez with Central Lock and Safe says most people who take these key programmers don't understand what they have. You know, in programming, it's it's a it's an ordeal. You know, you have to have knowledge. You have to there's sequences and whatnot, and everybody has their own little knack for it. So anybody touching a machine is not just going to be able to do whatever you want to do. Martinez says there are safeguards in place. Most key programmers are passcode protected. Another machine is needed to cut a special key, and some keyers have encrypted signals that constantly change. You need Need two or three things to come in and play a part before you can really get anything rolling. To keep potential criminals from rolling away with your vehicle, police say you should keep it in a garage if you can. Reg Chapman, WCCO News. If you don't have a garage, another option is a steering wheel lock. If you'd like to watch our full investigation into car thefts, just head to WCCO.com.